Hi everybody, happy new moon. I wanted to just hop on and just share in a little bit of excitement that I've been having today. I'm feeling really blessed and really grateful and excited to be sharing an intimate space with helpers and healers, therapists, social workers, counselors, uh, holistic therapists of all kinds, working with the body and also with the mind. Um, I, be I began my 10-week um, group tonight. Uh, this is the third time going through this group. And again, it filled, it sold out. And to me, there's such a testament of people that are willing to really do their own work. People that are in the helping and healing professions that are on the front lines of leading and helping individuals during this time are also really aware and willing to do their own work. The work that we do in these groups is not easy. It is a not, it's not a fun, fluffy group. It's not a process group. We deep dive into blind spots, defense mechanisms, things that we don't really want to see in ourselves. We do shadow work with archetypes. And we also get into the body, learning how to access the sensations and the emotions that are in our bodies that also represent our unconscious mind. So the more we feel, and the more we get into our bodies, the more aware we become of what's really been going on and also what parts of ourselves are asking for healing. So a lot of what I've been seeing recently is it's, it's really easy to sit on the other side of a screen and judge or point fingers or just be in this place of knowing or feeling like we really know what somebody else is doing wrong. And I'm so grateful for the individuals that are willing to step into a place of unknown and vulnerability and really do their own work so that they don't perpetuate trauma and they don't perpetuate more pain in the world. That's an unnecessary. So, so many times as professionals, we forget that we have trauma and we don't want to perpetuate trauma within ourselves or others because we're not aware and because we haven't actually done our own work. So I'm really stoked really excited for this group. Um, not only did it sell out, but we actually added an extra person in because we really just wanted everybody that could really participate in this to be able to have access to it. So the next 10 week group is going to be probably in a month or so. Uh, if you're interested in that, definitely uh, send me a message and you can get on the waiting list. Uh, it is the first step in the Yothera Method facilitator training. So it's a required part of the facilitator training. And I, I created the facilitator training in this way for this reason, because I don't want to train professionals in a, a modality what they, where they haven't actually gone through and done the work themselves. So hopefully, if you're interested, if you're in the helping and healing profession, you can also get CEUs from doing these groups with me. And if you have questions about the facilitator training, the certification program, um, or just this 10 week group, please let me know. You can also go to the website. So all of the links are in my bio and um, I hope to meet you on the journey. I hope you have a beautiful new moon. There's lots of um, really big seeds of intention being planted right now, intense seeds being planted and a lot of seeds with a lot of emotion being planted and uh, we honor that. We honor all of it. And so I hope to meet you. hope to see you on the journey. Have a beautiful new moon. Bye.